2022 GMC Sierra 1500 Limited Test Drive Review, Old Dog, Impressive Tricks. As has become a tradition among full-size American pickups, when a new generation arrives, the old one lives alongside it. That's exactly the case with the 2022 GMC Sierra 1500 Limited, a continuation of last year's Sierra 1500 in light of a new generation's arrival. Think of it as the old model lineup at a slightly reduced price, giving you a solid truck with all the necessities and none of the extra frills, competing with trucks of a similar ilk like the Ram 1500 Classic and Chevrolet Silverado 1500 LTD. It's ideal for those who need a workhorse on a budget or a cheap work truck that is supremely capable, able to tow up to 13,000 pounds in the correct configuration. You can even get a Denali trim that gives you a little bit of luxury on a budget. With four available engines including a 2.7-liter turbo gasoline engine with 310 horsepower, a 5.3-liter V8 with 355 horsepower, a 6.2-liter V8 with 420 horsepower, and a torquey 3.0-liter diesel with 277 horsepower and 460 lbft, the Sierra 1500 Limited has something for everyone. We were handed the key to a brand new Sierra 1500 Limited at 4 equipped with the Duramax turbo diesel motor for a week. This larger-than-life truck quickly endeared itself to us with its buttery smooth torque delivery and general comfort. With three cab styles and as many box lengths, as well as trims that cater for everything from work to off-roading and luxury, too, the 2022 Sierra Limited isn't just a cheap cash grab, it's a solid option in the USA's most demanding segment. The problem is the new Sierra isn't much more expensive but is vastly more capable, making higher trims in the Sierra Limited lineup tough to justify. 2022 GMC Sierra 1500 Limited Changes – What's the difference versus 2021 Sierra 1500 Limited? The 2022 GMC Sierra 1500 Limited isn't a new truck. Rather, it's a carryover of the pre-facelift 2021 Sierra, essentially a stopgap model, to boost sales until the fresher 2022 Sierra 1500, sans limited suffix, arrives. As such, most of what applied to the 2021 GMC Sierra 1500 remains relevant for the 2022 Sierra 1500 Limited. That means you still get a choice of four powertrains, including two V8S and regular, double, or crew cabs, starting at $2,100 less than the improved 2022 Sierra 1500 but saddled with a last-generation interior. Pros and Cons Exterior remains handsome and modern. Cheaper than new 2022 Sierra 1500. Solid powertrains. Capable at 4 model. User-friendly infotainment system. Dreary, dated cabin design. Upper trims aren't exactly cheap. We'd rather wait for the much-improved 2022 Sierra. Most packages are bundled with other expensive extras. Thin standard safety specification. Handling and driving impressions. We'll never miss an opportunity to keep praising the Duramax diesel. It's excellent. That being said, again, the Sierra 1500 Limited is still a full-size truck and it drives and handles like one. That's not a bad thing, but it could take some getting used to if you're not accustomed to trucks. Despite its dimensions, driving the Sierra 1500 Limited at 4 around town is a breeze. Maneuverability is aided on higher trims like ours courtesy of the backup and 360-degree cameras. We quickly adjusted to its size, even while parking, and the Torquey inline 6 was an absolute gem, especially when entering the highway. In this setting, it's easy to forget you're driving a full-size truck as the Sierra Limited is easy to place within the lanes and the steering didn't require frequent correction as is so often the case with body-on-frame pickups. Handling-wise, there was very little body roll. The 4WD system and the F4's 2-inch lift and X31 suspension further helped keep things nice and tidy. There's also an auto-locking rear differential and a 2-speed transfer case for the optional 4WD. We did notice the brakes were slightly sensitive, but this could simply be limited to our tester. Verdict, is the 2022 GMC Sierra 1500 Limited a good truck? Overall, our week driving the Sierra 1500 Limited at 4 was an absolute joy, 
mainly due to that silky smooth inline six turbo diesel. Having the crew cab makes the truck an ideal all-rounder of a vehicle. Our tester came equipped with the $1,095 driver alert package that included some safety must-haves like forward collision alert, lane keep assist, automatic emergency braking, adaptive cruise control, and front pedestrian braking. We wouldn't even consider not opting for these features and, honestly, they should be standard at this point. The added value they bring makes the GMC Sierra 1500 the complete package, comfortable, powerful, feature-packed, and safe. Above all, the truck is competent both on and off-road. For someone who doesn't understand why modern full-size trucks are so appealing to millions of customers, a few days behind the wheel of the Sierra 1500 will win them over. Our only concern is that the new Sierra is vastly better. And in the upper echelons of the Limited's trim roster, a mid-spec facelift Sierra is much better value. 2022 Sierra 1500 Limited Exterior There are no surprises here as the 2022 Sierra 1500 Limited looks identical to the 2021 Sierra 1500. It's a handsome truck but not quite as flashy as the facelift Sierra nor the new Toyota Tundra. The base 1500 Limited is typically utilitarian in its appearance with 17-inch steel wheels, black door handles, and black manual wing mirrors. At least it has chrome bumpers, LED headlights, and LED daytime running lights, so it doesn't look completely basic. The range-topping Denali is far removed from the entry-level model. It rides on shiny 20-inch alloy wheels and getting inside is easier thanks to chrome rectangular full-length assist steps. Upper trims benefit from GMC's excellent multi-pro tailgate with six functions, and elevation trims and above have LED fog lamps. A power sunroof is optionally available. Our Summit White 1500 Limited at 4 came equipped with the at 4 Premium Package, a $3,405 option. Among its long list of features, it includes Mud Terrain Goodyear Wrangler Duratrack tires for the 18-inch wheels. These came in handy during some funky weather in the Denver area as one day it was relatively mild outside, and then a few inches of snow arrived. Then it warmed up again, melting the fresh powder, before a cold front arrived and turned the slush to ice. Other notable exterior items include the very handy corner step rear bumper, 12 fixed cargo tie-downs in the bed, LED cargo area lighting, power folding and heated side mirrors, fog lamps, and cool-looking, and sometimes useful, red tow hooks up front. Owners will find especially handy the GMC Multi-Pro tailgate, which is available with both the short or standard box. Our testers at 4 Carbon Pro Edition package, $1,085, also added a corrosion-resistant carbon composite bed. Dimensions As with other trucks, the GMC Sierra 1500 Limited's dimensions vary widely since there are three body styles and three box sizes. The base regular cab with rear-wheel drive has a height of 75.6 inches, a width of 81.2 inches excluding the mirrors, a 139.6 inch wheelbase, and a length of 229.6 inches. This model only comes with the long box which is 98.2 inches in length. Other models in the range share a similar width of just over 81 inches, with minor differences. The double cab comes with the standard box only and this measures 74.4 inches, whereas the crew cab can be had with either the standard box or a short box, 69.9 inches long. Here, the wheelbases also vary. The double cab has a 147.4 inch wheelbase, whereas the crew cab's wheelbase is 157 inches with the standard box. The tallest model is the at 4 crew cab with the short box at 78.4 inches. Again, there are other minor variances from one model to the next. The AT4 is the best for off-roading as its ground clearance is as much as 10.9 inches when paired with the crew cab and the short box. Regardless of the model you choose, ground clearance will be at least 7.9 inches. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.